Hi friends, here your friend Bhutan Assembly and it really in one of the company for the post of so I will explain you step by step then this conversation in depth and if you have any doubt please take me on telephone group or any comment. Okay. Now coming to the sheet. Okay. Now actually what is the query this time? What is the query? Here wherever S is there, you have to take this take this store names over here. Wherever only S S are there. So no, no need. If it is yes, you have to pick up that one. As per date. Okay, here is a few conditions. Okay. So I will show you how to do this one. First of all, what I look at this one I'll how Yes. Okay. So I prefer everything I prefer some sort of something because it's very dynamic way. Yeah? I love this option. This was it. At the time I use this one only. I need to copy it for that reason I'm loading in this column but not now. So control C now and I will show you. Uh, sorry. So, Wherever S are there, it will show you the true and false. Then, comma means column, semicolon means true. Okay, after completion of these things, it will jump into the next row and again it will show you. Semicolon means row, column, comma means column. Okay, so it will keep each and every Sell and a value in that if it is there, it will uh, show you the true or false. And another criteria is if any date is any date afford equal to this and not to this column. Okay. Now see before going to here. Uh, for new people, I'm explaining. For going over there, is equal to two. First thing, letters always align to left, numbers always align to right, and logical true or forces and the errors align into the center. So it is a text, but it is a logical. So it will convert into a capital and it will align in the middle of the cell, center of the cell. Okay, so press enter. Okay, this is the thing. Okay, you have to remember this one for going to this function. Okay, now if I do like this into one, so it will pick up the one. Okay, it will pick up the, it will pick up the one. Okay into any number equal to number only 2 into 10 10 2 into 1 1 if I do it is into 0 0 means nothing but false okay remember this thing. okay if I type here just to check whether it is working or not see okay now I will show you this method I am using this method over here okay Now coming to this formula, coming back to this formula. Two. So what I will first of press enter F2 because I want to show you each and every step. Okay. Right. The problem with my keyboard F9. Here also I'll keep just the same thing. 
Wherever date is there, it will pick up the date, and wherever it is not there, it will not pick up that one. Okay. So it is the array form. Okay. In case my mouse is not working, I will hold it. Now, coming to the main topic of that parentheses and for what. It is taking over the other thing. This is the logical. That's nine, six, one, one. Remaining all are zeros. Only two are matching with yes and date. Okay. Now, what are you taking? Copy the string. So, see, what are you? Because I want the whole thing. Okay, I selected here as an array. So I take only one range. So I can say A to uh, B like A, A to B6 so and so on. B6 like this. Okay. But I took a whole uh, table. For that reason, I'm using this one. Let us check. Column of A3, F4. Because I need one, two, three, four, five, six, like this. Okay. Columns of dollar H3 for non H3. F9. So it will pick up the date. Okay. Why I'm using here? Oh, going again, I will explain you. Columns of dollar H one for non H one. So what it will do? It will increase the number one two three four. Six. So that parameter I use over there. Okay. Coming back to the formula. Simple. Now you want you want you want these store names. Index of this code F4, comma. So this is the index, and this will become the row number. Okay. Now let me check whether it is uh, it is all or perfectly ordered. Up to all should that, and it, it will give you the errors also. No need to worry. We can resolve that errors by using if error. This error. If you find any error in this function, give me the blank. If you have any doubt, ask me in the comment box section. Okay, wherever it finds, okay, so you may think it's wrong. Okay, so you Can it replies? But I think I did uh, this one. Two so, yes, 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 yes. Okay, okay, okay. No need to worry. There, they are there to solve the problem. Okay, no need. To
this thing. So it will pick up the corresponding where it is not there. Which one is it is not there, it will pick up that one. Okay. Okay. So it will pick up which is not available in this state. Okay. Now coming to this. I said you want to accept only the years. Okay, you want to accept only the years. <coughs> so first of all, what you will do, yet always be four characters. Remember that thing. Yet always will be the four characters. Okay. So what I'll do here, made of this comma. So in previous videos, I did this method. Right of this parenthesis. And if I type one, it will pick up every first character in a value. But here is four. So I'll type four. That's right. So it will show you like this. Okay. So now we have to ignore the text value and we have to pick up the number. So what you will do here, simply use double negative F9. So automatically it will ignore the errors. Sorry. Automatically, it will ignore the text and it will become the errors. Now, here it is. Okay, F9. We are interested in 2015, right? So, what I'll do, if you use max, max function will not like error values. So, you have to convert max to error values into blanks by using if error. Control six enter. Actually, you have to use max here. So it will pick up the max zone. Okay, guys, same as it is, but here you have to mention 10 digits. Same formula, F3, and for the same formula, C here, F2, F3, 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 Ten. Instead of uh, four digits, I'll pick up ten. F nine. Control six and by six. See here. I formatted like this. After it will show you some numbers. Control six and by six. Show you like like this. So I formatted like this. And then. Or else, control one, whichever format you like, you can go to that one. Okay, it's not a big issue. Then, the double ends, I use three ends. Okay, and uh, I'll come back with the solution soon. I don't know why it is giving this Now coming to this dynamic function. Okay. So, what I actually the person asked is here the values. If this value varies between in these two, in these two, then it has to pick up this one. Whichever value you enter, it should be between these two. Then enter, then it should come like this as per two conditions. One is greater than this and less than this, and the name should be this. Three conditions total. Okay, greater than, less than, and name. Three should match and it should pick up this. Three matches. Okay. So I did two methods, but I'll show you the easiest method. Okay. I don't want to show you the hardest method. Here I will show you the easiest method. This one two. This block only the block or at the top. Same thing. 
hash code is anything natural or equal to this. Okay, this is the first condition. This is the first condition. The condition is that wherever hash code is greater than or equal to this should be can as for not as for and another condition is that three conditions should met as for equal to this can yeah. i'm converting each and everything into 12 boxes because i have to multiply see f9 to 12 boxes 2 into 2 1 1 into 2 1 again 1 okay i'll come back to here and multiply by this. Whatever any doubt, ask me in the comment box. Okay. So simply use, everyone will use max, less, no, no, no. You have to add the, in some cases, you will misspell it. Okay. And it's not misspelled. In some cases, it will be any form. Okay. So it's normal function and some products and handle. You want you can check it here. Dan is 100. So, is there any 100 between 100? You have to check between 100. Let me check by using 21. Is it working? 21. See, between this. So, where I want to be. In between, there is 21, so it's a couple of different. In between, it's the same also, Ali. Okay. So, any doubt, ask me, brothers, comment box, or in the 